What's going on everyone welcome back to another video. In this video, we're going to go over the updated market watch. Um, things that I think is important to go over and prices are fluctuating because of certain things. Um, so with that being said, the first thing I want to go over is going to be the some of the companions. So companions... First thing I want to go over is the succubus. Now I'm not going to go over uh, like packs that these companions are in or anything like that. Um, compare the prices like that. Um, the succubus right now, purple is sitting at 4.2 million. Now the next thing we're going to talk about, the next companion is going to be the intellect devourer. Intellect Devour at green, it has a decent AoE attack that stuns, and it's sitting at 260,000. Uh, the next thing we're going to talk about is going to be the Dedicated Squire. Now you can get this um, with your Reaper Currencies, I'm quite sure, don't quote me on that. Dedicated Squire, this is pretty good count wide for a million not bad uh, the next thing next companion we're gonna go over is the pseudo dragon so PS E U D that should be enough right pseudo dragon green right now is sitting at 714k purple is sitting at 900 almost a million obviously I think the purple is your better bet right now it's purple is sitting at almost 1 million which is not bad the next one we're going to talk about is Staldorf now some of you guys might actually have Staldorf in your inventory somewhere if you're collective companions or whatever have you now start off green is sitting almost at 1 million uh, one two three four five six there's six under a million and after those six it hits to a million and then so on and so forth so right now green lowest 970 K so we got the succubus we have the devourer we have the dedicated squire we have the pseudo dragon stored earth next thing I want to talk about is some of the mounts now these mounts the Pegasus has been the Pegasus box has been removed Unless you have some, obviously, and they're not removed, obviously. Pegasus, the orange is sitting at 530, and the mythic, don't know why I searched that, but mythic sitting at 2 mil. The reconnaissance one, recon, CO, and should be enough. Recon, mythic, as you see, the mythic here is 2.6. Normally, the previous Mythic is a little higher than the current Mythic. So with that being said, the Pegasus with the previous, the Reconnaissance Balloon is the current. The Reconnaissance has a better bonus. The Pegasus, in all honesty, is trash. Trash. It looks trash. The bonus is, is not very good compared to this. That's why this, to me, is a little higher. So we talked about that. We're going to go to Mythic Insignia is now um, one of the biggest bottlenecks in this game right now is Powder and is the Greatest Shards. Now, with the Reaper Challenges, the Shards are a little doable. You know, you can get 30 a month just by doing Reaper. The good Insignias, now if you're just looking for item level, you can get a couple of cheap ones, you know. But the real good ones, the ones that people need, for, especially for DPS, like the skills and the um, brutals and the dominance, they are a little high. I'm not going to lie. So this Crescent Brutality Signia is sitting at 2 mil. Now, skills have hiked up in price. Skill, Crescent. Now, the thing is, a lot of... A lot of my bonuses don't have crescents, so this is doing nothing for me. Has some enlightens, has some barbs, um, has some illuminated. So we're gonna actually search just skill here, skill, and show you what I'm talking about. 
Lowest skill is almost 2.8. From that, it hikes up to 3.3, which is the Enlightened. The Bards are sitting at 4 mil. So, yeah. There's only uh, 7 here on the Auction House. And the lowest is Crescent, which is sitting almost at 2.8. Now, um, a little off the topic. I have nothing. No Crescents. We have, like I said, Enlightens, Illuminated, and Barbs. And as you see, I've started to get the cheaper ones, right? Obviously. So we, we talked about three Reconnaissance. We talked about Mythic, Insignias. We talked about the Stoddorth, Pseudo Dragon, the Dedicated Squire, the Pegasus, the Devourer, and the Succubus. Um, so those who farmed rank 5s, rank 5s have dropped down to like 30k or so. Well, last time I made a video talking about rank 5s, they were like a little over 40k. Now, obviously, I just messed that up, so let's go back here, rank 5, search, epic, not legendary, epic, sitting at 32. Now, there is another double refining stones in like two weeks or so, so wait if you can wait, buy them, invest in them if you want to invest. It's not a very good profit return, your return on your investments. For those who follow investments, um, buying these at 32 and selling them for 40k after the auction house fee is not, unless you're buying thousands of them, it's not really turning a profit. And with the uh, the reoccurring double refining stones, it seems like once a month. I've said it before. It seems like once a month. I don't know the actual like if that's the thing or not, but it seems like once a month they're coming out with double refining stones, which is good. Maybe that's their way of driving down the rank 5 market. But uh, I'll do an updated video closer to the next double refining and see where these are at. Succubus, Devourer. Alright, we're going to go over a couple artifacts. Now, um, I just made a video about this and farming Master Expeditions. And this belt is just ridiculous. So, the... Conduction cable is sitting lowest at three and a half mil. The only way that I know that you can get this is by farming expeditions, warden fragments, and master expeditions. Nobody really wants to do them. It's probably why the the price is so high. There's only nine on the market. Um, the, there's two for under four mil. There's three point nine almost four mil. We'll say four mil, three and a half, and then after those, it hikes up to five and a half. And after those two that are at five and a half, it hikes back up to seven and a half mil. Now, if I was an investing man and I had 20 mil laying around, I would buy these four and then post them up for 7.4 mil and see if I can turn a profit that way. And then um, after the couple seven mil, we have Luno 76 here with the cable sitting at 23 mil. What a freaking savage, huh? Uh, hopefully that sells for you, my guy. 23 mil. All right, so we talked about that, that, and that. That, that, and that. Uh, drift Globe. We're going to talk about the Drift Globe. Now, if you have these laying around, if you actually invested in these before the the switch to um, the keys and the switch to the, the leveling and things like that, you have Drift Globe sitting there. They're at 700K. For whatever reason, 700k. And then, if you're doing a Mies, right, and you happen to pull a music box, they're sitting at like 450k or so. Music box, 420k. Octor's music box. That goes along with the conducted belt. And the, the uh, neck doesn't sell for anything. A couple, couple k. Right now, it's selling for 90k. We have four here at 99k and then it hikes up to 102 there's 21 on the market so they're not going anywhere anytime fast you can get these from expeditions as well so let's go down the list make sure we talked about everything we need to talk about succubus devourer conduction cable rank five noble pegasus dedicated squire pseudo dragon star earth drift glow music box Mystic Signias, Reconnaissance, and only th the last thing we need to talk about, I wouldn't say we need to talk about, but the Assassin's Enchantments. We'll go to uh, Legendary, obviously. 
Uh, we're gonna just worry about rank 15s. Rank 15 is selling for 800k. Um, I'm not going to go over all the math that is associated with trade bars and comparing prices and all that, unless you guys want me to. But trade bar discount is coming up. Um, I want to say in 10 days, a week from Thursday or so. Don't quote me on that. I'll check at the end of this video. Trade bars, you can get a rank 15. I want to say for 800 trade bars. A lot of people are switching to this because of the uh, they don't need power, right? Who needs power these days? Everything has power for the offensive stuff, the crit strike, the combat advantage, and the accuracy. Um, if you're min-maxing, this is probably a decent way to go. Don't quote me on this. Again, I'm not like the best out there in stats and min-maxing, but the assassin chant is nice. Now, if you go to the trade bar discount or the trade bar merchant, I'm sorry. Enchants, rune stones. Go all the way down yonder. Wish you can like sort these, you know. Rank 15s are a thousand. You get 20% off, so they drop them down to 800. Here's your assassins. You can get them for 800. Like I said, then this video I'll tell you when that is. I want to say it's the 11th, but I could be wrong. Upcoming event. I've, I've checked like all the stuff here. Trade bar discount is the 11th, along with Dungeon Delvers, which is a good investment in your time, right? Um, there's going to be a lot of people running um, Dungeons demo for one, because the reach is still decent amount pay D and then we have a VIP discount which is cold word press word while we're on the topic of reach we'll go ahead and check out and see what the reach is at um, now again if you're looking for the reach I would wait until dungeon delvers right now is 1.1 mil it's going to drop under a mil for sure during dungeon delvers people are gonna run demo it's easy it's a good farm um, We'll look up the twine and the cord here. Those normally sit around like three to four hundred K. Again, if you're looking for the stuff, I would wait the ten days, right? I would wait the ten days. Twinkle Twine is sitting at four hundred K. And what I say, cord. Cord. Cord is sitting at three hundred K. Now these are going to drop for sure. Dungeon Delvers, these are going to drop. Save your AD, invest properly. Um, you're not going to run that much content between now and Thursday. Uh, I would definitely check Friday and Saturday, make sure you know I would run it. And if I don't get it by Sunday, I would probably just buy it at that point because it's going to be lower than what it is now, 100%. If these videos have helped you guys, make sure you let me know by liking the video. And if you're new here to the channel, make sure you subscribe and turn notifications on. I will leave all my social medias linked in the description below, Twitch, Twitter, Discord, and my gamer tag if you guys want to reach out to me and play on Xbox, because that's where I'm at. Thanks for the support, thanks for watching, and I'll see you in the next one.